I just love Superbase. I've been using it for a while on iCode this to handle authentication, to handle storage like this image of today's challenge and we're also using it for our database. All the projects here are stored on Superbase and it's just amazing to work with. They recently have launch week number 7 where they announced a bunch of new features. You can check them all out in the article below. But in this video we're going to focus on zoomable uploads, a feature which came in storage v3. This feature allows you to start and pause uploading of a file without losing the progress. Here we have an upload form using Goopy in a React app. We can simply drag and drop some files here and boom, they're ready to be uploaded to Superbase. And also look at that beautiful preview we have here. We can click upload and one by one will be uploaded to Superbase. And then we showcase them here below. Of course, this is just a demo project, so you can see how it works, but in your project, you can upload them and showcase them whatever you want. The nice thing with this is that we can upload a large file and we can pause it and resume and pause and resume again. This works great if your users have issues with their internet or they close the app before it finished uploading. Let's see how the code looks. As I mentioned, we have a simple React app and we're using Upi to have that built-in drag and drop uploader form. Next, we create an instance and we're using TUS, which is an open source protocol for resumable uploads. And we're setting the endpoint to our Superbase storage URL and using the non key, we can make the request. We can set the chunk size and the loud meta fields. And then inside our app, we have a couple of states. We're getting the images, a loading state and our error state. And then in the use effect, we're calling the get bucket function, which basically gets all the images from our storage using the storage name, which we're set in the environmental file. And if we don't have any errors, we're setting the images with the data we get. And also in the use effect, we're calling UP's file added and uncomplete methods. Then in the return, we can showcase the UP dashboard the loading state, of course, and the error states, if we have any. And then here at the end, we loop over the images and we just show them on the screen. Just as simple as that. With 100-ish lines of code, you have this nice drag and drop uploading with resumable uploads and all the fancy things. Pretty cool. If you want to have access to this code, I'll put a link with the GitHub repo in the description. In the meantime, go check out Superbase and launch week with these amazing features that they launched.